Well, hello everyone. I am uh, just got back from a little ride on the uh, on the Forza, and uh, I will show some video on that. And there she is, and this is the front camera. It's a Sony. This is the back of all the nicely wired stuff. <laughs> which I did not do. I did bolt on all the stuff, but I let them do it. And that was what I told in the live stream the other day was uh, it uh, eight hours, 400 baht for two guys. And they worked on it pretty much the whole time. So these can be adjusted to pretty much any angle for the GoPro, forward or backward, sideways, whatever. Um, put this bar on this one here. And this is obviously a beverage holder. This is a tire pressure gauge, tells me uh, temperature and pressure. That is the front and rear camera, GPS, and uh, uh, this is two USB extra ones that'll go for the phone and anything else that I need to charge. This is also uh, uh, solar charging. My, fo my phone, so I can play music. The other side, and uh, then I also put on this rack and this box. And this box is Shad 45. The 48 was quite a bit, I don't know, not that much bigger, but it was just, you know, this one was half the price. 3,100 baht versus 60, 6,800. And I think I've got plenty of room because I'm going. The only thing that I need now is the, I think they're 23 liter side boxes. And those are 7,900 baht. They're rather expensive, but they're, they got some real nice mounts. They're not real ugly, the mount, when the boxes are off. It's one arm, uh, and it looks pretty good. So uh, I think I've got pretty much everything. I'm going to, I just got back from a little short ride, and I will um, uh, download the uh, front and rear camera. We'll see what the quality and stuff looks like. And uh, then I'll probably post uh, a little short video. Uh, again, can't say enough about this scooter, man. It is, uh, it is awesome. Uh, rides perfectly, balanced perfectly. Uh, I, uh, I have no no complaints whatsoever. I just, um, I'm amazed. Like I said when I was uh, <laughs> doing the other video, I am thoroughly amazed. The scooter is, uh, is quite nice, um, and I can't wait to. For all this crap to be over with, so I can uh, I can go out and do a ride and maybe meet up with some people. So anyway, I will uh, end this on a nice little picture of the Forza. And like I said, it has plenty of power. Um, I was talking when we're on the live stream with Tony uh, Badger, um, and uh, that 500 he has is nice too. I think if that if I didn't just want just strictly a, uh, a twist and go, I would have definitely got that one. Anyway, uh, we will go, uh, go put this video together. Please, uh, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and like the video if you like it. Have a great day. Hope you enjoy the driving part of this video. This is the front-facing and rear-facing camera on the uh, on the new Forza. Um, it's supposed to be uh, their Sony camera. It's supposed to be 1080p. I'd like to get uh, your opinions, if you would, please, good or bad, in the comments on what you think of the uh, of the video. Um, you'll see here in a second that the camera on the right, <coughs> excuse me, the camera on the right, the rear-facing one, um, it has. A lot of shake to it, and I'm guessing that's because, or I know that's because, it's mounted to the bottom of the rear uh, luggage rack that the top box is mounted on. So I'm going to see what I can do to maybe stiffen that up a little bit or move that camera to a different uh, location. Um, but I'd really appreciate your input. If you have
haven't subscribed, please subscribe and uh, uh, enjoy the rest of the video. Thank you. Thank you.